Hello everyone, how is it going? Welcome back to Cry of Fear. This is episode 23, and last we left off, we were in this crypt, and we couldn't figure out what to do at the end. I, I mean, I got to the end over there, and there was a door, and there was like some sheep-looking monster that was screaming at me. But I don't know, maybe there's a door that I could go through? That's exactly what the monster sounded like. Yeah, maybe there's some doors- <laughs> Oh! <laughs> some door that I could go through. Uh, that I didn't see before, but I'm not sure. Oh, I forgot about the doors that I have to, like, go over. Oh, hopefully I can do it first try. It wasn't too bad once I got the hang of it last time. It just, if I fall, it's going to be annoying, because there's no save at this point. I have to go through the, the falling forest again and not go near the trees. That's okay, though. We're all good. I just want to make sure that I know what I'm doing once I get down there. Because last time was, I don't even know, it wasn't easy. If I do it first try, I'd be so happy, though. Alright, come on. This way, it's this way. Alright, we got this. Just go when it's open. Yeah, go now. Perfect. Okay, that one was pretty good. I think, I think I've got the hang of the sound since last episode. Go now. Yeah, we're good, we're good, we're good. That was lucky. That one opened right when I went over it. And that one just keeps open, I think. Yeah, that one stays open. Okay, we're good. I think there's one more, and then it's the trap one at the end. Let's see. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Let me get some momentum. That's not momentum. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. This is good. Okay. That has. Oh, that wasn't the trap one. Oh no. I thought that was the trap one. Alright. We made it back. I, I know that my strategy now is just to follow the wall in there because there's nothing that, that spawns along that wall and it's perfect. So I can just get there every time, which is all good. Now I can focus my efforts all on this crazy sheep thing down here. I. I thought I timed that one right, but I feel like I didn't have enough lead up of walking because I'm pretty sure I go faster the more I walk, but I honestly don't know how this game works too well. I can jump in here? I did not know that. That doesn't very help very much. Just uses all my stamina. I can't sprint or anything. I can't dodge. Can I dodge? And like, no, I can't. I'm not able to. Huh. Okay. I thought I was at like the perfect time for that door. I think it's just because I didn't have enough lead up, but I, I really don't know. Okay, let's try it again. We're going down. I don't know how it worked out so well the first time of me just falling down there without getting stuck on anything, because I've been getting stuck on everything. Oh no. I thought I just died. I thought I was about to just die. <laughs> I almost went a little bit too far there. Alright, alright. Come on, just go. Oh, that was close. That was too close. Okay, that, we're good for that one. That one's just a fake out. But this one coming up is real, and we need to have some momentum when we get into it. We need to have some speed. Please work out at the right time. Didn't seem. Oh no, I almost went. Okay, now, now, now. No, again. Oh, that's such a hard timing. So if there's not a door down there that I can go through, my second thought is that it's like a one of the chainsaw man little areas where I just have to run away from this lamb thing, because that might be it. Maybe if I go back to the beginning, when I run away from that lamb, there's an open door instead of nothing. I, I hope so at least, because if it, there's not, I don't know what to do. Alright, we gotta time this right, go now. Go, 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 go. Okay, that was pretty good that one right but that one's always easy okay and we're gonna go now oh no oh. okay we've got it this time this one's easy okay I can go a little bit earlier than I've been going each time I think that's why I've been falling because I've just been waiting until like the middle area but if I just go right when this goes down I should be fine yeah look at that that worked really well okay now I know my strategy right when it goes down is to start walking because it's gonna catch me when it comes back up so that should be okay for this one but let's just hope let's just hope okay oh what i thought i i thought i did not survive that wow that was actually insanely lucky okay and this one's the fake one i can't get across yeah it makes you fall okay thought so and what's behind these doors nothing okay oh my god <laughs> If there's a door that I can go through, that'd be perfect. Okay, okay. Oh, this one's like a slow opener. Maybe that. Maybe this one has an opening. No, doesn't look like it. Oh, this one opens quickly. 
Okay. It looks like it looks like it's gonna be a chase sequence. But I don't know. I don't think anything's open. I doubt it. Wow, this one opens slow. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Come on, come on. Because these really pose no danger to me, right? When I'm not running away from this monster. Okay. Well, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Go. Run, 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 run. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, you're kidding me. I can't do anything. I was stuck there. What was I supposed to do? I have no idea. So I have no idea what to do when I get there. That was my only guess as to, like, anything that I could do. I don't think I can get behind him, but maybe that's something I need to do? Because what else, what else could I possibly have done there other than go behind him in his area? How would I get there? How do I need to get- Oh my god. This one actually opens. I thought this one was just a prank one where, where you go near it and it opens or it closes. Okay, that scared me. That almost got me. Well, what I was saying was maybe I need to get behind him, but how how would I ever get behind him? I have no- oh no. What? Why did it make me go so slow? Okay, I don't really know why I, for some reason I'm going slow in certain areas, because I thought originally it was if you look down you start going slow, and then I thought is if you don't have enough momentum you start going slow, but I really don't know what it is anymore. Because any direction I go seems to be the same speed, but in certain areas I just slow down. For no reason whatsoever. I don't really know what to do. But look, I'm going so slow right now. I don't know why. Oh, that wasn't it. What just happened? Okay, well, <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but I'll take it. I'm fine with that working out for me. Maybe I'm not supposed to go down here. Oh no, I, I definitely am. Is there anything I can do? Anything possibly? Oh. And there's nothing behind those doors. I can't... I can't do that. Cause, like what? Yeah, I have to go behind this monster. There's no way it's not that. I have to run behind him. Hmm. I don't know. How would I get behind him? Alright, we'll give it one more try and see... Come on, come on. I see that door at the end over there. I thought I did. Maybe I don't. Okay. Okay, what can I do? What can I do? Because this one just stopped opening. It stopped closing me. There was no way for me to get around the monster, right? What if I just run straight into it? I'm running into it. No, I can't do that. I can't do that. Oh, and the door just killed me. What am I supposed to do here? Okay, I have an idea of what to do, but I have zero clue if it would work at all. So my idea is that this monster is not a boss or a scripted fight like I thought it was. Like like a, a chase sequence, I think it's just a monster that I can kill with my stick, right? Like, I could totally kill this thing, and I haven't even tried to do that yet. So, let's just, let's just try and hit it with a stick. Why not? But we'll see what goes wrong. But what's the worst that can happen? I get sent back to that area I've done a thousand times, that's okay with me. I hate timing this, I hate timing this. Okay, go now. Now, now, now. Wow, okay, that was perfect. Right when it, like, right before it even started to go down, it worked out. The ball down. I fell through the door. Okay, we're good, we're good. Just wait until this door opens and then closes. But the thing is, that there's no light down here, it's gonna be so hard to tell where the monster- Can you close? <laughs> Thank you. It's gonna be so hard to tell when I can hit the monster or not. I don't know, we'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. It, it has to work, right? Am I able to drop the lantern? Because that would be perfect. Let's try it, let's try dropping this. Is it still on? Oh, that worked out. Okay, okay, where are you, where are you? Why are you not there? I can't see anything. Wait, is he in there? Yep, he's right there. He's right there. Okay, he's hitting me, but I think I'm hitting him back. He's just standing still for some- Oh! That worked! That worked so much better than I thought it would. Wow. That surprised me. I thought that was not gonna work at all. Okay, well, we're in the next area, thank god. <laughs> Finally moving on from that platforming section, which... It's not easy to do, especially with this engine.
Okay, what's going on? It seems like we're going and leaving this area. Well, I was editing the last episode, and I remembered on the other side of the train tracks, there was a crypt entrance that looked just like this one. Is that where we're going to exit from? I'm assuming that's probably what's going to happen. Where are we? Maybe not. What is going on? There's some lightning. Yeah, where is this? It's leading to a door. Should I try that door? Or that's not even a door. Where is this path leading to? That's a weird path. Okay, I don't want to waste all my stamina just in case someone lunges out at me. Because I feel like in the deep dark of the forest that's going to happen. Oh, these street lamps on this random path. I'm glad there's some light. Maybe I should get my weapon out. Oh, a cutscene. It's the doctor. He's back. Where is he going? That's odd. Into like a mansion area. What's over there? Let me check out over there before I follow the doctor. Is there anything? I think it's just the cars. Yeah. And I doubt I can do anything over here. No, they're just more destroyed cars. This guy has a huge wealth of destroyed cars. It's impressive. Alright. We're going in. Following the doctor. What is this place? It's like a, it's totally like a huge abandoned mansion thing. What is this? Can I go over here? Don't think so. I'm just trying to look around, make sure I don't miss a save because I don't want to die here. We're gonna lose a lot of progress if we do. Maybe there's one behind this door. Hopefully, let's just try it. Or we can go in. I thought it was gonna be locked. There's a save. Okay, I'm using that right away. What is this save called? Let's see, let's see. Mental hospital. Oh boy. That's not the place you want to be in. Especially in the middle of a forest. It's locked from the other side, okay. I am one hit to like any enemy. Oh, it's so dark in here, it's so dark. Is this Simon's mental hospital? It's possible, right? Maybe we're about to wake up in the in the hospital. What is this? That's a window, not a door. I thought it was a door just raised above the ground. Confused me. A broken sink in the washroom with no toilets. Interesting design. Wouldn't be my first interior design choice, but you do you, I guess, hospital. What what are these rooms? This is so odd. Okay, I guess they're like little uh rooms for each patient. And another sink room. What does that say? That doesn't look like it's English. I think that's like Cyrillic alphabet. I don't know. I think I went the wrong way because there's nothing down here. But it was an attic. Never mind. Hmm. Okay. Well, there, we could go this way as well. What's this door? What is that thing? Can I interact with it? I can't interact with it. But I do hear some screaming. Open the gate blocking the staircase. Needs electricity. What? There was nothing blocking that staircase. Or is it down here? No, there was nothing down here. What? Or is it this gate? It's this gate. This is what it's talking about, I think. But that's not really blocking the staircase. Oh, I'm getting deep into this hospital. Where am I going? This is an odd hallway. Where is this taking me? Oh, I hate this. Why is this so deep in the hospital? Yeah, I can't go that way, and I'm going through here. thought that was going to be locked for a second. I was about to say I went down that staircase for nothing, but nope, I didn't. There's door after door after door. Where am I headed to? A generator? A flashlight. Oh my god. That's so nice. I don't want to use that lantern anymore. What is this? Can I turn it on? Or is it already on? Because there's no lights on. What is going on in here? What do I do? I have to be able to do something. Right? I'm trying to interact. Oh, right here. What is this? What? A, B, B, C, C, D, D, E. Okay, well that worked. I just pressed every button and it worked. And now the lights are on. Locate the doctor. Am I gonna kill him? What was that noise? Maybe it's the doctor trying to escape through a window? Because he knows someone turned on the electricity. Oh, it's still really dark without my flashlight. I'm gonna keep the flashlight on. Oh boy. Go through the door here. 
which way did I come from? I came from over here. I don't want to go down the hallways I haven't gone down yet. Maybe I somehow located it perfectly, but I doubt it. Oh, you know what? Let me try that gate down there. Maybe it opened up with the electricity. You think so? It did. <gasps> okay. Well, it was a lucky assumption, but there is a monster down here. I see. Oh my god. I forgot these things do that, and I'm one hit. I can't afford to die right now. Okay, we're good, we're good. Let me assign the flashlight to number one, the lantern to number three, because I'm going to be using the flashlight a little bit more. What is this place? Fire doors are sealed shut. I feel like that's not up to safety standards. Bowling alley in a mental hospital? Huh? This is out of place. Can I, can I get strike? No. So... What is that? Changing rooms. What are these? Soap bars. I thought that's something I could pick up. Doesn't look like it. What is going on? Hmm. This is weird. Regler. Visa Hansian. I don't know how to say that. Okay. Hi, buddy. I see you in there. There's nothing back there. Do I really need to go fight him? I think I do. I'm just gonna see because there's probably something back there for me. <laughs> Please tell me- oh, a magazine, but I don't have a gun. Why would I need a magazine? Am I gonna find a gun? Maybe it's back in the changing room. I'm going back here, I'm gonna fight him. It's worth it. It's worth it. He's not damaging me. We're fine, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. I can't see anything, I can't see anything. Maybe we're not fine. And another magazine, why do I need so many magazines if I don't have a gun? He's cornering me. Oh no, why did I trap myself? I trapped myself. Okay, we're fine, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, is there a gun somewhere in here? Because I'd, I'd love to get the gun to use this magazine for. Hmm. No, I keep on thinking those soaps are th something that I can pick up, but I don't think so. Someone hit a strike and got a gun. Perfect. Okay, I'm dropping the lantern, to be honest. <laughs> okay, assign that to two and that to three. Sucks that we don't have as many inventory spaces as last time. Is this a Glock? Same Glock as last time? No, it's the P35 Ruger. 345, not three, four, not 35. Alright, let me reload this. Do I not have any ammo? What? I guess I picked up the wrong gun. I've just been getting Glock magazines. There's something strange about Dr. Purnell. Dr. Purnell, could it be? That's our doctor. Is that his name? Weird. I didn't even mean to click on that. <laughs> Good thing I did. Interesting to the story. Okay, well here's the door. Is broken. Oh my god. I don't have a gun. I don't have a gun. Okay, he killed himself. That's not good. I don't mean to dual wield that. Let's see if I can drop that. Pick up the Glock. Perfect. Okay. I'm gonna dual wield with these two. Okay, let's go down here. That scared me. I wasn't ready for that. Oh, what is this? I see you guys. I'm ready around the corner. Oh, they... Wow, he one-shot me. Oh my god. Well, I think that's a good place to end off this episode right here. Thank you so much for watching. There's a lot that happened in this episode. We got a name drop of the doctor. Now we know... I swear, I just heard footsteps running at me. I'm just gonna sit still in here. We got a name drop for the doctor. Dr. Purnell. That's interesting. And we're now in a mental hospital? Could this be where Simon has been? Really? Like, truly this whole time? I have no idea. Well, thank you so much for watching. I really enjoyed this episode. I hope you did too. And if you did, I'd really appreciate a like or even a subscription. It would make my day. Thank you so much. I'll see you on the next episode. Bye-bye.